square root of 9 plus 4 plus 1, square root of 4 plus 25 plus uh, 9, And it should be the same power. So again, it's 10 to the minus uh, 12. So tell me what you get there. That's the most negative potential energy that this dipole will have when it's lined up. So tell me what you get there. Okay, so here's how I get their final velocity then. When, it, when it's, uh, that's the highest velocity that it's going to have when it's lined up. I say the potential energy initial must equal the potential energy lined up plus the kinetic energy lined up. Okay, right? So the potential energy initial is the 38 picojoules. Potential energy lined up negative 46.13 picojoules plus the kinetic energy half times the mass of the system right well each one has a mass so I'm assuming their mass is the same so the mass of the system is 2 micro kilogram v squared So there you have it. This negative goes to the other side and becomes a plus. So uh, that'll be 14, 1, uh, 84.13. And then the 2 and the 2 cancel, divided by 10 to the minus 6. And then take the square root of that. And that's the velocity. Now, if it was, a, uh, if it was a physics 2, I could now combine this with the physics 2 concepts, and I could say the velocity of the particle determines its temperature. So I could say 3 halves kT is equal to 1 half mv squared, right? The kinetic energy of the molecule is what gives it temperature, and that's what's going to heat up the molecule, and you and I eat the chicken or the soup or whatever, right? So it's due to this velocity that the molecule warms up, right? It's probably been not too high here. Or I could do 0.92 centimeters per second which is still fast for a molecule because a molecule molecule is so small if it's going that fast then you could uh, and then if you want to combine with physics 2 is anyone here taking two, physics 2 also both classes I know there's several people doing that you could go 3 halves kT Boltzmann's constant and T equals half mv squared and from there you can find the temperature of the um, molecule Mm -hmm. Good, huh? I like combining several things and showing you the bigger perspective of, you know. Okay, good. So next time then we'll come, we'll start with chapter 27. <clears throat>